Telecommunications in the Gambia includes radio, television, fixed and mobile telephones, and the Internet. Topic: Radio and Television. Radio, the state-owned Gambia Radio and Television Service has two AM stations, Bonto, Boss, and three FM stations, Bonto, Saracunda, Bonjul. There are also seven private FM stations in Saracunda, Bonjul, and Boss. Transmissions of multiple international broadcasters are available, some via shortwave radio, 2007. Radio sets 196,997. Television. The Gambia Radio and Television Service operates a single channel TV service with the main transmitter at Bonjul and numerous relay stations. Transmissions of multiple international broadcasters are available. Cable and satellite TV subscription services are obtainable in some parts of the country. 2007. Television sets 4000 1997. Topic: Telephones. Calling code: plus two two zero. International call prefix: OO. Main lines: sixty four thousand two hundred lines in use, one hundred fifty ninth in the world, twenty twelve. Mobile cellular: one point five million lines, one hundred fifty first in the world, twenty twelve. Teledensity, approximately 80 per 100 persons, combined fixed line and mobile cellular 2011. Domestic Adequate microwave radio relay and open wire network 2011. State-owned Gambia Telecommunications Company Gamtel, partially privatized in 2007. International Microwave radio relay, links to Senegal and Guinea-Bissau 2011. Satellite Earth Station, 1 Intelsat Atlantic Ocean 2011. Communications Cables, Africa Coast to Europe ACE, Fiber Optic Submarine Cable 2011. Topic. Internet Top-level domain, GM Internet users, 229,122 users, 151st in the world, 12.4% of the population, 165th in the world, 2012. Fixed broadband, 497 subscriptions, 188th in the world, less than 0.05% of the population, 178th in the world, 2012. Wireless broadband, 22,435 subscriptions, 131st in the world, 1.2% of the population, 132nd in the world, 2012. Internet hosts, 656 hosts, 179th in the world, 2012. IPv4 to 21,504 addresses allocated, less than 0.05% of the world total, 11.7 addresses per 1,000 people 2012. Topic. Internet censorship and surveillance The Gambia is not individually classified by the OpenNet Initiative ONI, but is classified as engaged in selective Internet filtering based on the limited descriptions in the ONI 2009 profile for the Sub Saharan Africa region. There are no government restrictions on access to the Internet or reports that the government monitors email or Internet chat rooms without appropriate legal authority. Individuals and groups can generally engage in the peaceful expression of views via the Internet, including by email. However, Internet users reported they could not access the websites of foreign online newspapers Freedom, The Gambia Echo, Hella Gambia, and Jolov News, which criticized the government. The constitution and law provide for freedom of speech and press, however, the government restricted these rights. According to the Observatory for the Protection of Human Rights Defenders, the environment for independent and opposition media remained hostile, with numerous obstacles to freedom of expression, including administrative hurdles, arbitrary arrest and detention, intimidation and judicial harassment against journalists, and the closure of media outlets, leading to self-censorship. Individuals who publicly or privately criticized the government or the president risked government reprisal. 
In March 2011 President Jama warned independent journalists that he would not compromise or sacrifice the peace, security, stability, dignity, and the well-being of Gambians for the sake of freedom of expression." Accusing some journalists of being the "...mouthpiece of opposition parties," he vowed to prosecute any journalist who offended him. The National Intelligence Agency was involved in arbitrary closure of media outlets and the extrajudicial detention of journalists. In 2007, a Gambian journalist living in the U.S. was convicted of sedition for an article published online. She was fined US 12,000 United States dollars. In 2006, the Gambian police ordered all subscribers to an online independent newspaper to report to the police or face arrest. The Constitution and law prohibit arbitrary interference with privacy, family home, or correspondence, but the government does not respect these prohibitions. Observers believe the government monitors citizens engaged in activities that it deems objectionable. In recent years before the 2016 election social media like WhatsApp, Facebook and Skype have been temporarily blocked in the Gambia. Since 30 November 2016, the evening before the presidential election, Internet access, mobile communication and phone calls have been completely shut down by all providers, as ordered by the President of the Gambia. See also Afrasel, mobile telecommunications company operating in the Gambia, Sierra Leone, and the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Gamtel, the Gambia Telecommunications Company. Qcel, Qcel Gambia Co. Limited, the Gambia Telecommunications Company. Comium, Comium Gambia Co. Limited, Telecommunications Company, is fully owned subsidiary of the Comium Group Luxembourg. Netpage Limited, Netpage Gambia Co. Limited, Telecommunications Company. Quantum Limited, QuantumNet Gambia Co. Limited, Telecommunications Company. Visicom, a global satellite internet provider with coverage in the African continent.